Ivy! Listen, if you've dropped out of school, could you give me a heads up? I'll arrange other transportation. Keep your shirt on. And I mean that both figuratively, as in hang on a minute, and literally, as in no one wants to see your pasty hairless chest. <laughs> Today is picture day, and I need to make up for last year. I remember that. That was the year you helped Santa guide his sleigh. And freshman year was no better. Is that why you stopped eating spinach? All leafy greens, actually. Better safe than sorry. I don't see why you're making such a big deal out of school pictures. I haven't had mine taken since I was nine. Well, faculty will be getting their pictures taken, too, so you may want to put something nicer on. I mean, look at you. I always look like this. Oh, so you know. What's so important about getting your picture taken? What's so important about getting your picture taken? What's so important about getting your picture taken? Either you're repeating my question for effect, or I'm stuck in a time loop, forced to relive the same three seconds over and over. I think I'll just skip the photo. You can't. Without a photo, you're a nothing, a non-entity, a Jesse Thomas. Who's Jesse Thomas? Exactly. <laughs> Jesse missed the photo last year. Who is he? Or she? We don't even know what gender Jesse is. Is that who you want to be, Jesse Thomas? I think people know what gender I am. Do they? Hairless chest. Do they? OK, everyone. I thought we'd have class outside. So in honor of photo day, we're going to learn about photo synthesis. <laughs> Although, in reality, the two events are completely coincidental. And that joke came from a service I subscribe to. Lame jokes for science teachers. <laughs> now, plants are the only living organism that make their own food. They make their own food? That's awesome! <laughs> I wish I could do that. It gets tiring having to take lunches from nerds every day. Plus, they all have food allergies. Getting pretty sick of soy nut butter on gluten-free flax bread. Wait, Slab, are you engaged? Of course not. I find marriage to be an antiquated institution. No, I mean, you're actually interested in what I'm teaching? Did you hear that, guys? <laughs> so this is why we don't have classes outside. Slab, I... Guess you're the only person who didn't leave my class. This is where I often come during your class. You came to me. Mind if I play through? Sorry, I'm late. Ah! Quit screaming, it's just me. I knew that. A real gorilla wouldn't apologize for being late. One of those talking gorillas would. If he was raised right. If he was raised right, he wouldn't be late. Are you saying I wasn't raised right? I'm saying you scared me. You're afraid of gorillas? Of course not. What reasonable person would be afraid of gorillas? I'm afraid of gorilla suits. Why? It's a long story. Well, I'm not interested in hearing it. Then why'd you ask me why? Because I was raised right. <laughs> no, no. Turby, why are you wearing a gorilla suit? I wear a costume every year on picture day. my thing. <laughs> Are you the front or back of the horse? Neither. I'm the rock. <laughs> well, I've got to get to math class. Mr. Buckley hates it when I'm late. You're late for my class all the time. Can we talk about this later? Mr. Buckley's waiting. <laughs> hey, Derby. 
Yeah, go. Mind if I leave my cups here? Mr. Buckley doesn't like clutter in his class. And what you got there? Oh, nothing. Just the last school photo I was in. Uh -huh. You were so cute. But your last school photo was when you were nine? Yeah, after grade three, they just graduated me. But then you missed all the fun years. I did get to go to a frat party when I was 10. <laughs> Man, did I drink a lot of milk that night. Just gotta stay looking like this till the end of the day. anything about being a kid. I mean, why is it here? I'm going to recreate all the major milestones you missed growing up. Starting with age 10, when boys notice girls for the first time. I'll be on the swings. Come over and just start talking to me. I feel a little silly. You're supposed to feel silly. You're 10. You've got the awkward thing down pat. Now use it. Ready? Hi, Echo. Do you want... Ew! A boy! But I... Bro, get away from me. But you... I don't want your cooties on me. Whoa, whoa. See what you missed out on? You're welcome. You got all those girls to play along? What? I don't even know those girls. Halfway through the day and still spotless. Sloppy Joe's, fries and gravy, spray cheese. How am I going to preserve this? Whoa! I'll cover myself up. Ah! What are you doing? I was here first. Hot as a gorilla. Quiet. Ready for dinner? Don't you mean lunch? No, silly. Now we're 12. That's when boys are ready for their first kiss. You take me to a movie, then this restaurant. We're on a date. We are? <laughs> Great. So, did you like the movie? I couldn't really pay much attention with your hand on my knee the whole time. I think we've come into this reenactment a little late. I hope you don't mind me putting on lipstick. My mom won't let me wear makeup at home. She says I'm too young, but I think it looks nice. Do you? <laughs> I do. <laughs> I do think it looks nice. <laughs> and it tastes great, too. Just like cherry. So tasty. How can you not like cherry? Mm. <laughs> ah! What do you think you're oh. doing? Uh, age 12? A first kiss? How can you not like cherry? Mm. What kind of girl do you think I am? My mom was right. Boys only want one thing. Kiss this. Oh. 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 See what else you missed? You're welcome. I'm sorry, but I need my gorilla suit back. Mr. Buckley hates it when I show up to class in my underwear. I used up all my warnings. But how am I supposed to stay clean the rest of the day? We could probably both fit in there. <laughs> You're thinking about it, aren't you? <laughs> Mr. 
Mr. Young? Slab? Do you have a court date of some kind? <laughs> yeah. That's not for a few weeks. I'm dressed for picture day. It's funny. I didn't think you'd be into all that school spirit stuff. On the contrary. This means a lot to me. High school is a very tough time for a lot of people. And when they look back, I want them to remember that it was me who made it very tough. <laughs> Anyways, I want to talk to you about science. Science? I teach science? <laughs> yeah, I realized that today. <laughs> and I can't stop thinking about photosynthesis. I spent the whole morning standing in the sun, but I wasn't able to make any food. <laughs> well, I did chew my fingernails. That's more of an appetizer. <laughs> You can't make your own food. What if I promise to listen in class? <laughs> that would be nice, but still, only plants can do photosynthesis. What do they have that I don't have? <laughs> Leaves, for starters. That's where chlorophyll is stored. Got it. Thanks, Mr. Young. You know, this stuff is really interesting. Someone should teach it. <laughs> I wanted to give you this. An invitation to senior prom? The final milestone you missed when you skipped all those grades. Oh, I didn't miss it. My mother took me out for a milkshake. <laughs> we even rented a limo. <laughs> that doesn't count. You need to have a real prom. I don't know. I'm still trying to get the last milestone out of my nose. Come on. There's no moment more special than prom night. It's the night girls become women and boys become men. I'd like to be a man. <laughs> and they call my brother the genius. What's that smell? That would be me. <laughs> I've covered my entire body in cow manure. Oh, I hear that really opens the pores. Unfortunately, it also lets the poop in. I'm using it as fertilizer. I also cover my body in soil and seeds. Water away. No, that's enough. I don't want to get root rot. Now, to soak up some rays and read a little more about photosynthesis. <laughs> Photoautotrophs begin the process by absorbing energy from. the only tuxedo they had left in my size. Well, I hope you didn't spend your whole pot of gold on that. Can't believe you set all this up for me. Oh, it was no trouble. I went home and changed into this. I wanted to look nice for my picture anyways. Then I borrowed all this stuff from Derby. He even offered me a horse-drawn carriage, but I didn't think it was worth $40 to go around the school once. Okay. Actually, it's a breathtaking experience. <laughs> Especially when the moonlight hits the flagpole, just so. <laughs> uh, anyway, this is for... You're already wearing a corsage? Yeah, I got it from Toby. <laughs> is he your florist? No, he's my date. Hey, babe. <laughs> so, where's your date? My date? You didn't ask anyone. To senior prom? <laughs> I, I guess you could hang out with Toby and me. Is that okay with you? <sighs> oh, I love this song. Let's dance. You're so shy. 
Why? I mean, it was cute when we were 10. You should ask someone to dance. Do you want to dance? That is so rude. You know I'm here with Toby. I might ask someone else. Yeah, there must be a pixie or a garden gnome around here somewhere. Sorry, I'm late. I had to tend to the horses. Did I miss the whole prom? Darby! You ruined my dress! Sorry. You scared me. You're afraid of leprechauns? No, of course not. What reasonable person would be afraid of leprechauns? I'm afraid of leprechaun suits. Derby, I know I scared you, but did I really make you cry? It's not Derby. <laughs> I made Derby give me the suit when he ruined my dress. It was a nice dress, but that looks great, too. It's not the dress. Toby dumped me. He said he didn't want to dance with anyone who had a hairier chest than his. Lucky for you, I don't have that rule. You're not afraid of the gorilla suit? Not anymore. <laughs> Almost time for my picture. Guess I'd better unwrap my dress. I'll help. <clears throat> ah! Leave me green. Stay away from my teeth. Where are you going? I thought you wanted to help. Leave me alone. Seriously. Thanks, Adam. I feel better. And I'm sure when the time comes to go to your real prom, you'll end up going with a guy who doesn't care how hairy your chest is. Awesome. Yeah. I guess there's no rush. I feel the same way. One of the great things about being a kid teacher is I'll get to experience all the big moments of high school with you. Guys. You guys. You know, you and Derby and the guys. That's true. And so what if you miss standing in a schoolyard having a girl say, gross, get away from me, and shoving you to the ground? Gross, get away from me! <laughs> I guess this just proves no one looks beautiful on picture day. Come on, everyone. You don't want to miss your picture. Uh, Derby, what are you wearing? Oops. Nice catch. A princess would never wear a calculator watch. She has people to calculate for her. He means the dress. Where did you get the dress? From my locker. I always have a backup costume. Then why didn't you let me wear that instead of giving me this gorilla suit? I don't understand the question. an amazing salad. <laughs> you like it? I made it myself. <laughs> A four-leaf clover. This is my lucky day. <laughs>
There he is. Get him! <laughs> oh, God. God, you leprechaun. What are you doing? Ah. Oh. Quiet. Well, none of your leprechaun tricks. But I have to get to me class. I mean, my class. Echo, tell him I'm not a leprechaun. Oh, we know that. We just don't want to study for tomorrow's science test. <laughs> Let me out! Come on, please. I'll give you me pot of gold. <laughs>